Hello YouTube, um, <clears throat> today I'll be showing you a quick review on the new iPod Touch, the second generation by Apple. So, um, first of all I'm going to go over the look, so here's the, well, the front part of it. So what you have here is the home button, I'll show you what it does in a minute, and the screen. On the right side, there's nothing, it's just, well nothing. The back side you have the iPod sign, well the Apple sign, and here you have sort of your wireless data same antenna I guess. And um on the left side you have your volume control. Top side you have your standby button and bottom side you have um the earphone slot and here is the charging slot. So that's basically the looks of it. Okay, so now I'm just going to show you what it came with. So it came with these earphones. So it's the ordinary Apple earphones, and it's a universal um, earphone jack. So it goes basically into most things. So that's quite cool. Because in the first generation, I think they didn't have it. I'm not sure. And it also came with the charger. So the charger this plugs into the iPod and the other end plugs into the computer so that's kind of annoying you can't charge it you need a computer to charge it or a Mac and um... but you can also buy these almost anywhere it's it's this plugs into the iPod and this plugs into the wall but that doesn't come with the iPod so that's a bit annoying but it's not doesn't matter too much okay so when you turn the iPod on so it says slide to unlock so you slide it, just going to hide it to put my code in there we go so this is the home screen so um... what I like about these iPods and iPhones is that it's not just an ordinary push and it'll drag, you have to sort of use quite a lot of force to make it move which is quite cool so um... that's a feature of the Apple devices that is really cool so um... The application it comes with, so you've got Safari, which is Apple's version of Internet Explorer. Then there's the calendar. There's your mail, so you can set what email you have and all. There's a contact list. Now remember, this isn't the iPhone, so you can't call. You can just store contacts. You've got the YouTube, so direct access to YouTube. You've got stocks. You've got maps. So I love this application. It's really good. You can... um get satellite images but it's basically it's Google Earth and you can also if you change the options you can get maps so basically you can get instructions to get to the Empire State Building or whatever you want so that's cool so go back to the home screen by the way when you're when you're anywhere you press this home button you come back to here so that's cool um then you got your weather application so you just click that and it'll tell you the weather for a week's time you got the clock. So what's cool about the clock is that you got the uh, the world clock, which you can put all the clocks you want. You can put uh, Africa, America, France, Europe, anything you want. It's really neat. You got alarm. So what on your ordinary alarm? The stopwatch. So you start, stop, reset. It's cool. And then you got a timer. So it'll ring. For example, you can make it ring in one hour and fifteen minutes. Well, I think at least that's what it does. I haven't tried it yet. Okay, so other applications. So, uh, got clock calculator. So calculator's neat. So this iPod's got an accelerometer. So if you turn it, there you go. It goes into a scientific calculator. So you get a lot more options there. I don't know if you can see. And then you turn it back to um, portrait. It goes back. So home screen. Calculator, then there's notes, so you just write a bunch of notes. Settings, the Apple Store, so you can buy things from your iPod and then directly synchronize it onto your computer, so you don't need to go on your computer but to buy things. And those are the default apps that come with the iPod. Now, there's also music, so any iPod comes under music, so that's cool. Um, then there's, well, the videos, so you can store videos onto the iPod. It's quite cool. 
and it's really good quality I think the iPod but you always view videos landscape not portrait okay home screen you can store photos so any photos of anything and then there's um, iTunes so iTunes is similar to the App Store so I'll let you discover that out so those are the default apps um, that come with the iPod so really quick I'm just going to show you um, the difference between the first gen and the second gen uh, okay so the first gen uh, I don't think had speakers, no it didn't so um, the speakers on the iPod Touch second gen I think they're located somewhere over here because the sound comes out the charging slot and also another feature is that it didn't have the volume control so um, back to the home screen okay so I'll just show you really quick what the standby button does well first I'll show you other things so say you're here you click the home button go back to the default apps say you're on the calculator you press the home button go back to the default apps so wherever you are you press the home button you go back here um, this, the volume control so you this is to put it down so as you can see as you do it there's a little icon and this is to put it up very simple like most things um, now um, the uh, it's not that loud the, the iPod Touch 2G um, I've heard uh, samples of uh, the iPhone playing music and the iPod Touch isn't as loud as the iPhone so if you have an iPhone don't expect it to be as loud as the iPod I mean expect it to be louder than the iPod Touch and if you have an iPhone don't get an iPod Touch because an iPod Touch is the same thing as an iPhone but it doesn't have a phone so it's the iPhone's better in, in some ways so um, that's basically it and really quick the standby button so screen you press it it goes into well standby mode so to bring it back up you press the home button or you repress the standby button and it comes back up so you slide to unlock you can put a code the code is optional so that's the basic review of the iPod touch um, keep on searching if you want to find in, find more detailed reviews about this uh, iPod touch uh, second generation okay thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe, rate and comment. Alright, thanks.